Ready? Let's do it. All right, guys, it's May 20th, 2023. We are doing the Castle Rock Trail. And Ray's taking us up a different way. It's the secret locals parking, so. <laughs> oh, I'm already tired. <laughs> We got the Spartan race up here too. What's that all about, Ray? Oh, dude, I don't know. I you... really don't know. It's just a crazy chat, uh, obstacle course. <clears throat> I thought you would have been all, all, all for that. No, <laughs> those people are crazy, man. <laughs> those people are cray cray. I know some people have competed it, and they, you gotta be like on your game. There ain't no eating cheeseburgers. Yeah. I'm definitely not making that race. Hell no. That's brutal, dude. Can't wait for my Kratom to kick in. Just, uh... So this is where everyone comes and sleds all winter. As yes, as you can all see. All the freaking garbage. Yeah, it's horrible. All the plastic. You got everything. You got a baby diaper. You got a wine bottle. So, so, how far are we going on this Castle Rock Trail? Uh, mile each way. Okay. Oh, good. It's short. So less than half of what we did last time. Yeah. Sweet. Because I'm dropping out. I got to be on the road to go down the hill at 1230. You're giving me such an out, man. Thank you. <laughs> no, this is horrible. <laughs> Guys, look. This is This is what folks do to... Our beautiful environment up here. And we have to come clean it. Every year. Alright, help them up for a second here. Does it get flat up here at all? Yeah. Okay. This is a pretty steep trail. High use. Do you think this is the highest used trail in Big Bear? Pretty much. Okay. Oh yeah. It's gonna wake me up for sure. So this morning I woke up to some rain at about 5.30. Whew. Oh wow. Yeah, it's a pretty cool view for the road from here. There's the road right there, guys. Yeah, that part gets the blood going. Yeah, for sure. Ooh. I feel it. What a beautiful morning. It is gorgeous, man. It's so humid, though. We're going to get some good thunderstorms today, for sure. Oh, yeah. All right, you ready? Let's do it. Yeah, usually I see people walking up this huge thing of rocks right up here, down there to get up to Castle Schmack. Castle Schmack. Castle Schmack. Have you ever been there? Never, dude. This is my first time. Oh wow. Yeah, I've heard good you things about. You can climb on it, but uh, I know, it kind of involves a little rock climbing, and I'm not cool. Yeah, I don't want to be. On belay, belay on. I just want to hike. <laughs> you just leave a rope there and be cool, but it's your stink bug. Oh, yeah. So the actual trailhead's down there. Where those people, where those are. people are hiking right there, yeah. And then they come up this really steep angle, right? 
Right here? Yeah. That's the actual trail down there. We're doing a little shortcut. Which has been marked. I'm wearing my pajamas to go hiking. That's ridiculous. Same. <laughs> Same. <laughs> I was going to put on shorts, but it felt a little chilly still, you know? So we'll be getting up, up here to the views and stuff, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. Well, they're, <coughs> they're not a really good view. It's not like a view like we had at Cougar Crest, dude. Okay. You're just going to see a big rock and a big waterfall. Okay. What's that trash can full of rocks right there? Those are car carins. They mark the trail. I see. Okay. This trail kind of scatters in a lot of directions. Side paths. Okay. So to keep everyone on track. I need to get a little fanny pack instead of taking all this stuff. <laughs> the quick hike is not bad. Well, guys, look, at least the first half of this hike is uphill, and then the second half will be easy peasy. If you want to stop, dude, let me know. Okay. I'm trying to get us to the waterfall before all these people behind Oh, it. sure. To climb on it as opposed it's to gnarly, dude. Stress. Gnarly. How's it going? Hey, good. How are you? Doing well. Thanks, guys. Yeah, so I think it's I'm going to have to take a break, dude. I know I sound like a, w a wuss. Take your time, bro. Ain't going nowhere. Just for a sec. Oh. Just going to Castle Rock and back, dude. <laughs> All right, guys. Have a good one. You too. Yeah. Yeah, baby. That's not really... Feel the burn. Yeah. I'm going to feel so good tonight, though. I know that. Just give me like two minutes and then we're out of here. Take your time, dude. Thanks, Ray. It's a beautiful day. I just don't want to be that guy, you know? Oh, there's never that guy. <sighs>
All right, I can probably go. You good? Yeah. Yeah, for no. a little bit. <laughs> wow, okay. The other day I, I went to uh, the uh, Grout Creek area and uh, I have I put together a 12 hour video of just that waterfall for background sound oh. nice. to help people sleep and relax. Nice. So I'm hoping it works out for them. Grout Creek? Yep. That's the, the one in Fonskin? Correct. It's taken two and a half days to upload. It's still uploading. Burn? Burning. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Bro. <laughs> I like it. Like I said, I can barely even turn my neck to the right, dude. Yeah. yeah. Thanks for coming, man. No, thank you. <sighs> I can hear the waterfall. Okay. The cool air feels amazing now. It does. It's helping a lot. Sun this morning. <sighs> yes. Climb the stairs, Nick. Ah, yeah, yeah. Deluxe stair climber. <laughs> you don't get this in the gym. No, you don't. <sighs> Oh wow, look at that waterfall. Let me go in front, you follow me. Okay. Can we go squeeze oh, by real quick, boys? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Uh -huh. Take care, guys. Yeah. Right, be careful, honey. Watch your back. Yes. There you go, my man. Oh, wow. Flat rock. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Ray, this is great, man. For sure. You want to get up here? You know what? Bath. You mind if I, I, I take out my phone to record this for 10 straight minutes? Uh, dude, it'd be insane. Do it. Because I'm going to use that for one of the 
relaxation videos. Well, we might. If those people show up, we won't be waterfall. No, off. sure, sure, sure. We sit here as long as we can, huh? Thank you, Ray. No, thank you, dude. This is. Do you hear that sound? Oh, dude, it's. It's crazy, dude. That Chinese philosopher. The wise man knows it's much better to sit beside a mountain stream than to be the emperor of the world. Who said that? Chong Tao Tuan Ta. I don't know. I, it, it's a Chinese, you know, an old, it's old. Confucius. Yes. Confucius say elevators no different to midget. <laughs> Confucius say, man with hand in pocket feel cocky all day. <laughs> Confucius say, man who run in front of car get tired. <laughs> man who run behind car get exhausted. <laughs> all right. Here we go. Let me get it. Yeah. yeah. Well, we're not going to go. You want to come up here? You're welcome. I just need a couple minutes here. Yeah. Dude, this is insane. This, this is beautiful. How you doing, man? Really? Yeah. And more snow melt. Yeah. Do you want to come up here, man? Oh, I'm in no rush. It's just water. I can open up the water. No, it's not the same. It's not the same. Get in there and stick it in. It's all right. It is. All the snow from like Yosemite into Upper Mountains are making their way down here, huh? Not Yosemite, bro. This is all from above us that way. Oh, well, that's yeah. From above us. Yeah. From Bluff Lake and, uh, um, yeah, right? It's up there on the 2 and 10. I tried to hike up there about two weeks ago and yeah. there's still five feet of snow up there. Mm -hmm. yeah. I couldn't even find this uh, road to get to Bluff Lake. Uh, another three miles up on the trail. Yeah, oh, a lot of them. I'm not going to go more than that. I'm going to go more than that. I'm going to go more than that. I'm going to go more than that. The signs are going to go more than that. It's like a piece of the bridge. Yeah, it's a piece of the bridge. You've got to have a lot of good food. You guys, I am so out of shape. You guys do the same. So, you don't mind if I do like seven or eight minutes of, of just pure peace? Yeah. Okay. Because then I copy and paste it like 70 times to make the, the long videos. All right. Because I don't know the next time I'll be up here. Thanks to you, bro. I know, dude. Just I just about died halfway up this oh, damn thing. That's why. You can way down. Well, now that I realize it's not that far. I mean, I've hiked like that with a 50 pound pack on, and it's really slow. Yeah. <laughs> All right, give me a few minutes.
not. No, I just kept my hand going up and down the fall. So for seven straight minutes and then I'll copy and paste, it's just gonna be that and that sound yeah. for 12 hours though. Yeah. Just so people can have it in their background. Yeah. I think that's, dude, I, this is, a, this is a, such a beautiful waterfall. What's it? What's this one called? Is this Castle Rock Waterfall Dude, or something? I have no idea if it's got an actual name. The next waterfall. That's, 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 that's what I'm going to call it. It's, uh, yeah, and it don't run all year. I don't know how long it's going to run this year. It's probably run a lot longer, bro. You hit it in the springtime, bro, and it's always fucking amazing. There's so much, so much snow melt. You have no idea. <laughs> I mean, literally, right on that rock, right around these rocks right here. Oh yeah, all bet. Oh shit! <laughs> hours. Dude. <laughs> got my heart. <laughs> That's why I was like rushing to get here. You know, I, I, I love this spot. Dude. No, it, it felt like it was calling your name, like no joke. Yeah. Like. That's a beautiful feeling to be in touch with nature like that. A couple of weeks ago, there was still a bunch of snow all around. I bet that would have looked amazing. Oh, yeah. no. Oh, no, Sap. Ah, I got Sap. <laughs> it smells so good, though, dude. Yeah, it does. Oh. Wait, you watch? No. <laughs> no. No. Just smear it on your floor, <laughs> Yeah, thanks. So this is what people come up here for. Well, you notice that we're only ones hanging out here and those other people stop by for a minute. And then they, they, they turned around and went back. I don't know if they went down or if they went to go further up. We do have a pretty good looking rain cloud over us. Yeah, we do. So we can walk a little while longer, but it starts to sprinkle all the time to turn around. Yeah, we can try. That was a nice little break. That was a nice little break. Watch your back, dude. Yes. Thank you. I know because I fucking nailed my back. All right. Oh, great. Oh, great. Look at these steps. <laughs> <laughs> Take your time. Oh, hey now. Well, I take two steps. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Starting to get a view over here. Look at that. Wow, Ray. Wow, wow, wow. What happened? What happened? There goes my water bottle. Uh, well, that gives me another break. It's <laughs> trying to help me, aren't you? Please be careful. You guys, don't mind my friend, the sailor. I love him so much, I don't want to tell him to watch his mouth and stuff like that, so I gotta be careful because I love him to death. He dropped his water bottle, there he is right there. All the, he's all the way down the bottom. Look at that view though, straight ahead guys, look at that. Hey, I just saw a lightning bolt, Ray. Did you really? Right here. For real. For real.
Look at that guy going straight up, straight up and down right there. I'm trying to, to listen for it. I mean, if anything, one of these trees would get hit first and not us. We'd be the collateral damage. <laughs> the last place you want to be is standing on top of Castle Rock. Really? Right now, if you just saw lightning. It was right here. Yeah. Right there. Well, I trust your judgment, so I'll keep going until you... Uh... Guys, these are trail markers right there. Very cool. Very cool. Woo! What's that freaking conservation core thing? Okay, let's get him thrown off. See, I'd be so lost. The other, look at the rock. Look at the rock. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay, yeah. So okay. I see how you follow them along? I see. Another one, guys. So we don't lose our way. Look at all these beautiful rocks up here. Wow. Things change on each trail. Each trail has its own characteristics. I heard just in this national forest, if you really took every square inch of, of, of every trail, it would take you over 20 years, even the most avid hiker, to hike every square inch. Wow. Does that sound right or no? I don't know, I've been here for 42 years and I think I got it pretty well. Yeah, I do too. <laughs> I mean, I've done the PCT from Onyx Summit down to the Cougar Crest Trail. That's pretty fun. That's a long one. Very long way, 26 miles. Mostly downhill at first, right? Yeah. Oh, look at this area. Wow, look at that. It's a good spot to go up on that rock. That one up there? Yeah, I'll show you. Guys, look at that. Oh. You go first. Wow. Oh, wow. That really pisses me off right there. What? Oh, that really irritates me I so much. I did it at first. Look at that, guys. Graffiti. So annoying. I've told all my friends on this channel, if they ever see someone like intentionally throwing stuff out their car window or doing stuff like that, feel free to lay down a beating. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, keep that stuff down the mountain. I moved away from that stuff because I, I, I wanted to be in a beautiful, peaceful area. <laughs> Do you think that's easy to, to scrub no. off? No? No, I don't think so, that, my friend. I know it's not much, Ray, but I feel like I accomplished something by getting all the way up here right now. Hell yeah. I really do. And then this crazy, beautiful view of the lake right there. And you've never seen Castle Rock. Is this Castle Rock? No, no, you're in for a tree. Uh-oh. <laughs> I am excited. It's very big, bro. Well, thank you. Right, be careful. Let me ask you, uh, is it a lot more uphill? I'm not gonna wuss out. A half mile. Another half mile. Let's do it. Let's do it. It's weird, I'm, I'm getting that same mentality I got from my first week of the three week outward bound. Yeah. Where we're like, dude, I was in tears, in tears. And I had to have a 75 to 85 pound pack, and I only weighed 125 pounds. Oh, yeah. I showed you the picture a mile. Yeah, you, know? you did. That was cool. The coolest thing ever, man. All lean and trim. Oh, dude. Dude. 18 years dude. old. You, you look like an Abercrombie and Fitch model, bro. <laughs> <laughs> dude, that's carrying that 60 pound outward bound pack. Yep. Dude. I put that thing first on, I was like, 
You're kidding me right now. <laughs> yeah. So the instructors are like, set it on the picnic table and then get into yep, it. Yep, yep, yep. That's exactly how they told us to do it. Set it up on a rock, even, even height with your back. What the heck? Guys, look at this. You could come camping up here. Oh, shit. Oh, no. <laughs> you all right? Yeah. Surprise. That's something we need to bring is like Neosporin and stuff like that. What do I do that on? I bet. What do I rub against, dude? I don't even remember rubbing against anything. Getting the old man skin, bro. See, look, the bandana, bro. There, see, we were talking about the importance of carrying these bandanas with you, and this was one of the reasons. Yep, instant bandage. And also to filter your urine, if you, <laughs> right? Oh. <laughs> I just, I'm not gonna drink my urine, Nick. <laughs> we're a phone call away from friends that'll come rescue us. <laughs> I just want an excuse. Right. <laughs> Bear Grylls urine crystals. Yeah. Bear Grylls Oh, that's <laughs> <laughs> well, that smells really like piney over there. It smells really good. That was really nice. You got some pine smell? Yeah. Love it. Oh. Love it. Absolutely love it. So my assumption is Castle Rock looks like a castle with like rock formations. Huge rock. Yeah. Okay. Morning. Morning. Google Maps app. Satellite view helps. Yeah. Because there's so many collateral trails that I just keep going off. Oh, <laughs> there is a lot. There, that's why. Yeah. I've lived here forever, so I kind of know where it is. I got it. I got it. I rubbed up against something. <laughs> guys, have a good you, you too. You too. Thank you. I feel like such a schmuck in, the, in this hat. Why? No, dude. Because this is too much for me. Well, when the sun's out, you want it. That's, that that's true. That's true. That's, that's true. You're gone, bro. That's true. The sun protection in your glasses, your hat, whatever you wear is critical here. Especially at critical. this altitude. Yeah, you're right. You're right. What do you think? We're about 7,600 feet here. Do you have an altimeter? No, I do not. On my phone, it works without any service. Really? Yeah. What would you guesstimate? The lake is what? 60... 67. 67. 6752. To be exact. Have you ever camped up here? Uh uh. Never been camped up here before. That would be awesome. So. I like to go camping in San Gregorio. Yeah, that's... I like to go up there. That's a real wilderness over there. Big, yeah. huge wilderness. You know, they limit the number of people that go in every day. You have to have a permit to get in. <sighs> Big 
peaceful this morning now. Oh, this is beautiful. The sound of the running water is magical. It is. It really is. Hope you guys can still hear that. I'm sure you can. <clears throat> so that stream that dumps off into those rocks must be just right over here. Yeah. Those are the ones that, that's what makes the waterfall. Yeah. Oh, yeah. There it is. That's it right there. Yeah. We're going to follow along it up the canyon here. It makes me want some iodine in a bottle just to old, live the old For flavor. old time's sake. Yeah, man. Mm. Iodine flavored water crystals. <laughs> <laughs> no, dude, I remember that. It was like not kind of gnar sometimes. All the water in the Deschutes River, because it was roaring so much, it was it, it had a nice dark brown tint to it. But I'll tell you what, though, I didn't care at all. As long as I believed that the iodine was going to clean the water and we wouldn't get dysentery. Yeah. Oh yeah. You don't want that. Or giardia. Or giardia. Yep. Yep. Cryptosporidium. Watch your mouth. <laughs> All those dudes are no bueno. No bueno. So I know I sound like such a little baby. Um, We've done the hardest part of the hike, right? Pretty much. Okay. No matter what, I'm I'm going, but Yeah, this is, this is I need some some good mental like uh and all this running water is helping a lot. Wow, the trails do branch out everywhere up here. Do. Guys, we could go up there, we could go down here. This is where the, there was a, this is where the trail was and then that tree fell. How's your arm feeling? Good. Good. It's kind of surprising. I wish you rode a, a bike, dude, so we could go riding together. I have a mountain bike. No, well. Oh, a, a motorcycle. A, a motorcycle, yeah. A motorcycle. Of course you have a mountain bike. <laughs> you could probably ride that thing faster than I ride my Harley. No. <laughs> you going front for a while. Whew, okay. People don't want to see my butt. <laughs> there it is. Okay. That's it. Oh, look, another little waterfall. Sweet. So beautiful. It really, it's, and just that sound is just magnificent. What? That's rough. Oh, that, that, oh my gosh. <laughs> Holy smokes. I'm like looking around. That's obvious. Holy moly. This is the side people do a lot of rock climbing on. Okay. I have a couple friends who are in some rock climbing groups up here. they've done it. Is that a tent? Where? Oh no, or that rock looked like a tent with the blue bag oh, inside. Oh, blue? Yeah. Looked like a blue bag inside. Tripping. Tripping, bro. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, downhill. Oh, <laughs> yes. For two seconds. For two seconds. Huh. Tag, <laughs> you're in. Yeah. Is, is this where we're going? Yeah. Okay. Can we just take a quick break before the... Oh wait, are we going over here? Yeah. Oh, sweet! This might be a little tricky. Hey now! <laughs> wow, that's a big rock. This is way harder than that Cougar Crest trail. <laughs> it's short, but it's steep. Yeah. Look at that, you guys. Look at that. Holy moly. Think I could take a 10 second break? Yeah. <sighs> so guys, around the back side. That's Castle Rock right there. That is a huge rock formation. Yeah, it's got a huge flat top. It's pretty cool to get on. You find someone that'll dare take you up there. <laughs> I'm glad you won't. <laughs> it'll, it'll be a it's good sketchy for me, dude. Yeah, hold on a sec. I swear, I, I promise you, I just need just have some water, homie. You haven't had any water. Oh man. I feel the humidity now. Yeah, it's smoking. Just a couple deep breaths and I'm good. No, take your time, bro. Thanks, Ray. I'm gonna take a couple deep puffs. All right. Perfect. Perfect. So over on the other side there, you see the trail over there? Yeah. That's the way you go to continue up the Bluff Lake. Okay. Okay. Someday. Someday. I know once I lose 35 pounds and get back in shape, this won't be that bad. Uh, do you want to lose 35 pounds? Yeah. Cut out soda? Yeah, I'm afraid to because it's all I drink is Sprite. Mm, my favorite. And the Starbucks mocha frappuccinos. Yeah. In those glass bottles. Yeah, every month I spend a few hundred bucks on those, f fill up my fridge. I mean, if you saw my fridge, it looks just like MTV Cribs. Just lined, el everything facing straight. And like just uh it's just all like you worked in a store? Yeah, yeah. It's all drinks. But the expensive drinks. Right. But you only live once, man. And I know I probably won't live a long time if I keep on drinking all that stuff, but I try to I live in my sodas for one or two a day. I wish I could do that. I'm about a six pack minimum a day. I was at a time in my life. Big gulp every day. 
me too. I would drink a couple of those a day. Especially when I lived right next door to an AM PM. Like right across the street. And they were 99 cents. Yeah. You got a huge drink. Dude, like a swimming pool. I have on the cab of the dash the trash truck all the right the dashboard right there all day long. When I was drinking those, I was in my Diet Coke fix. Diet Coke phase? Yeah, yeah. Because of all the bad news with, with like aspartame and stuff, like I went back to regular soda. Right. It's like, shoot, if I'm going to be damaging myself, I might as well enjoy it. Yeah, I think the sugar, you're better off hitting the sugar than trying to freaking do with the chemicals, you know? I agree. 100%. Sure, the sugar's no good, but... I'm telling you, those little three to five minute breaks help a lot. Oh yeah. A lot. Oh, look at those rocks up there. So Ray's climbed on top of those before, guys. We're not doing that today. But... <laughs> We are almost there. Yay. That cloud cover is nice though. <laughs> Even though it's humid as heck. It'd be a lot longer if the sun was out. Yes, it would. Oh. Wow. So do you just climb up this part right here? Well, scramble where that guy is over there. Okay. The sign right here? Yeah. Literally been here since I was 16 years old. Wow. When this tree was alive. So we're at Castle Rock. Yeah. I made it. Okay. You made it. No way, dude. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, dude. For someone who's so out of shape like me, this is an accomplishment. No, it's good, man. Thank you. Little steps, big victory. Hey, do you know what? You'd be a, a great like uh, counselor for those outward bound trips, dude. <laughs> you really would. You're very inspirational and motivational and you don't lie about the distances like my old best friend nick did ah uh, we're almost there <laughs> yeah literally he was like it's about a mile and a half and then we get to a point on the on the path where it says six and a half miles till our destination wow and at the start he said it was a mile and a half Top where that girl's going. Okay. Yeah, that's a good, that's a good too. Maybe some other time. You're halfway there, girl. Go to the top. <sighs> See, I gotta shimmy up that one rock. Okay. It's sketchy coming down. That's where oh, my, yeah. the sphincter does a little high pucker. <laughs> Especially with some drops of rain if coming you'd down. I'd like to follow them. I'm good, dude. I will be more than happy to wait and help you down, whatever. You can go up there. I'll go, I'll go, I'll go to right here. Yeah, we'll go up there. Okay. Up there. All right. That's where, we, that's where we usually come in. Oh, look at that view. Look at that view. No way. No way. Hang on a second. Yeah. Let me, go on. Just yeah, thank you, Ray. You can even take your pack off and stay down here. Wow.
Guys, he's, he's on top. Nice. <laughs> Guys, this is Castle Rock. That's the worst part right there. What's that? Right there. I hate that part. Wow. This view is something else. Oh. Look at that view. Yeah. What is? Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. I forgot to bring my uh, little thing for us. Uh, That's too hardcore for me. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. He he doesn't mess around, man. He's got the best quality out there. Some of these peaks I don't really get to see when I'm down there. Those peaks that are way out past Baldwin. Yeah. The round one, the round one right there is Tip Top Mountain. On the right? Yeah. The one sticking up. Yeah. The little nipple. Yep. Wow, man. Where the, the old road mine is. Uh, I think I can make out Stanfield Cutoff right there. I really hope our lake stays stays like this. When I was at Grout Creek yesterday, there's so much water still flowing into the lake. <laughs> it's great, it is so great. I can't believe I've been here eight years and I've never been up here. Damn, bro. It's crazy. That is a little crazy. This is a historical spot. I think Elvis has been here, dude. No kidding. I think Elvis has been here. Oh. Hm. Got some boats on the lake right now. Alright, I'll see you down there. Not that many boats though. Ray, thanks again, man. Of course, dog. I I wish my wife was here with us. She would she, she had to work and do some other stuff early, earlier. Who did the unnecessary crossing the stream? <laughs> Where are you guys from? San Diego. Oh, cool, man. Cool. Welcome to Big Bear. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. There. Really? This is like his third or something. He came here during, you know, tour season. Sure, sure. <coughs> it's pretty chill. Yeah, it is, man. Yeah, it is. I came up here from from Newport Beach eight years ago, <coughs> and never went back. <laughs> It's just so, just so beyond peaceful up here, man. How was the snow this year with all the rain? It was the best year that I've seen in the eight years. I actually run a YouTube channel called uh, Big Bear Weather and More. Oh, okay. And I've got tens of thousands of subscribers. And uh, um, I record every storm that we have. And, and yeah, for the eight years, this has been our snowiest and wettest season. And it looks like this next winter... Dry. No, man. It looks like a serious El Nino is going to kick in, which means for our area, it's probably going to be mostly rain for the heaviest parts of all the storms. But for our lake, we'll definitely take it. But for our tourist season, because we rely on the tourists up here, yeah. without you guys, none of us get to live here. Yeah. 
yeah. So uh, if we get a whole bunch of rain in the wintertime, that's going to be a problem. That, that's what's looking like might happen. <coughs> but I never, like, all these, like, <coughs> lakefront homes are, like, really lakefront homes. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. The water's, like, when, we were, when I was driving over there, I was like, damn, it's, it's, it's coming up. Yeah, big time. Bro, it's, it's, it's come up. It, it was almost 19 feet low at the beginning of this last rainy season. Now it's, like, five five 5.4 feet low, which is just, I mean, huge, man. Lake Powell. Beautiful, Lake Powell. huh? <laughs> dude, seeing Lake Powell so low, or how low that it was, was, dude, horrible. To where it is now? Yeah, it's just m magnificent. Yeah. But that was sad seeing that, man. Uh, I mean, like, uh, as a kid, we used to go there, jump off of the rocks, and, and just really enjoy that area. And to see it almost empty was just remarkable. Yeah, it came back. Even, um, I think Salt and Sea came back, too. Really? <coughs> nice. I think some of it, not all. At least it's gonna last another. You know, couple They're trying to find a way to keep the water in the salt and sea, and to actually have a flow come back to it. That's, well, you can't because agriculture around there. Yeah, area. yeah. They're eating yeah. everything up. Everything. Yeah. You guys have all the salt in? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Agriculture is around that area, so they're just eating whatever water that is supposed to be feeding it. And then they're dumping all the all the stuff from the from the uh, runoff back into the salt. And yeah, that's that's why nothing can live in that sea, right? Yeah. Yeah. It's like super, super acidic. Yeah, like super acidic. Birds and shit die, right? Yep. Yeah. And birds still fly in there. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go eat, Mark. For show. For sure. Ribeye is a potato. Nice. Dude, that sounds so good, bro. That sounds so good. Yeah, yeah, Like, yeah, if yeah. you're going back to Georgetown, yeah, we're going to I don't know if they have alcohol. Yeah, we're going to have alcohol. I like a slight lack of sleep. I was like, if I could just like a mile and a half from the trail, I'd get it. Oh, we're thinking of a spot in the village. So yeah. We got brunch and all that. Yeah, you go to that. Yeah, Teddy Bears? Oh, Teddy Bears? Who serves alcohol, though? They oh. Social has a bar. Yeah, yeah. I, social club in, in town. I know they do breakfast and they got a full bar. And social's off of um, Pine Knot, so Pine it's Knot. it's on the main drag. Oh, okay. We should see it. But, we saw Pine Knot. Yeah. yeah. But if you guys do want what's what has been known for many years as the best best breakfast up here, it's called the Grizzly Manor. Grizzly Manor. <laughs> yeah, and it's on Big Bear Boulevard. As, as you're going back in, into town on the left-hand side, you... Past the village, it's probably half a mile on the left-hand side. I think we saw that last night. We did. It's it's Manor, yeah. super famous up here, and it's been in magazine after magazine for many a years. All right, cool. Let's if go anything, there. We got the seltzers and tequila in the car. <laughs> there you go, oh, dude. Yeah, yeah. There you go, man. Doing Good it right, shot. man. Good yeah. shot. <laughs> Doing it My right, favorite. guys. Thank you, guys. Yeah, no worries. You guys stay the safe. It's a breakfast drink, right? Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> My favorite. June, absolutely. June twenty third. I'll have ten years without alcohol because I'm a recovering alcohol. Ten yeah. years, dude. Dang, nice. But I still. <laughs> Thank you. There's a campsite. Oh yeah. Yep. That's actually what I do up here. That's Growing. that's my business. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you're a grower. Uh, I'm in the industry. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, is there a dispensary here? Um, Ooh. do you have a phone number or do you have your phone? Yeah. So yeah, here, here, I'll. I'll... That's super cool, man. I'm a very personable person. I could tell. <laughs> I could tell, bro. But Ray, I, I love living up here, man. And when I meet people who actually really appreciate this place, that like, oh man, I could talk to them all day long. Yeah, no, those guys are cool as hell. You ready? I'm ready, Freddy. And guys, I'm excited. It's downhill all the way. I sound like such a pansy, don't I? <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you. Downhill's harder for me than going uphill. <laughs> because you have bad knees, though. No, not bad knees. Just older knees. Old, <laughs> older knees. Older knees. Guys, I'm not gonna tell you Ray's age, but you would never guess. I'm afraid if if I ask him to act his age, he might die. <laughs> 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 Act your 
you're age, Ray. <laughs> no, I don't think I ever will. I don't think so either. The guy's full of energy. 31 days of skiing this winter. Yeah, guys, he went up skiing 31 days and he works at the resort as well. He's, you're a uh, lift ops, right? Still? Yeah. Ray does a little bit of everything up there, you guys. He's, uh, he's, he's one of the OGs at the ski resort for sure. And my good friend and my tour guide. <laughs> that day, dude. It really is. I appreciate the different days today. No sun. It's just the flat lighting. It's it's different. Yeah. Than yeah. when it's sunny out. I've been up here when it's just mist. Oh, I bet walking through the fog through here must pretty be sick, um, yeah. pretty amazing. Pretty Two weeks ago, all the snow up above, that blew me away. And you said just a couple weeks ago, there was still snow next to that waterfall, right? Yeah. That, that See, that would have been beautiful for my relaxation video that I'm gonna post, to have snow on, the, on those rocks. But still, that waterfall was still nice. Can't believe I'm a... A freaking YouTube guy. I always hated YouTube. <laughs> Has anybody recognized you in public? Uh, every every single day. Really? Every single day when I go to Staters. Careful. Oh, th thank you. Or, or or when I go to just anywhere where there's lots of people every day. It's like, oh my gosh, you're the YouTube guy, right? And it's mostly people that don't live up here. Wow. Yeah, I've signed autographs for kids and stuff, dude. It's the, it's what? the, it's yeah, it's the coolest feeling ever. What? All these grown-ups want photos with me and stuff. Yeah, man, it's it's just really cool. Never saw that coming. I'll tell you that. You Oh, <laughs> guys, look at the size of that rock. That's that's the backside of Castle Rock right there. It's humongous. Trekking poles would have been good, at least for me. Mm -hmm. Hi guys. How's it going? What a trip. That dude looked just like my cousin. That's a trip, man. But the one thing that hasn't happened yet, even with over 20,000 followers, is I still haven't had someone say, hey, from, uh, we went to the same elementary school or like something. Oh. Nothing like that yet. Oh. I'm still waiting for that because I, I, I think that'll be cool. Right, Because right. I'm still a midget just like I was back then. So as Ray said, if we cross this creek and head up that way, we're going up to Bluff Lake, right? But, right, dude? Yeah, yeah. Okay. So guys, we just did the most popular hike in all of Big Bear. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, can you pull the golf snow? 
guys that have these micro spikes in the group. So that's what you went up? Yeah. Dude, are you kidding? Yeah. Do you guys see how steep that is? Ray hiked that a few weeks ago when it was all snow. Dude, you, you're, you dude. I, I hope. Had spikes, man. The spikes are critical. So this is the stream that created that waterfall that we stopped at at the beginning of the hike, guys. So beautiful. Carpenter ants. Monsters, jeez. Carpenter ants. They're the workhorse of the forest. They're the ones responsible to help the wood decompose. Really? Yeah. Look you know how big they are, guys. It's a finger next to it. What will it do? Nothing. To show you the size. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Do they bite? I'm sure they do. I'm not going to try to catch gonna... one. Oh, my gosh. Beautiful. Beautiful day, dude. It's perfect. Good morning. It's right perfect. There. Heck, yeah, bro. Good morning. This is what I needed before I head down the hill. So I'm going to be asleep for the rest of the day. This is just your warm up. <laughs> nah. It won't be long, bro. You'll have this. So that's cool. The, the guy's going to check out this video once I post it and leave a comment. Hello. Hi. Wow, that stream is beautiful, man. It really is beautiful. <clears throat> so guys, once again, Ray was honest about the distance of the hike. Couldn't be more grateful. <laughs> 10 miles. <laughs> See, if you say that and then it turns out only being three miles, then I'd be like, damn, I love this guy even more. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm feeling good. Poop flower. Oh man. Irritating flower. That's the worst of the worst. I'm telling you. That really grinds my gears. Yeah, you probably will, trust me. <laughs> I'm so out of shape, you guys. I got like 10 breaks to go. <laughs> See you guys. So are all these trees down due to dead trees or rock slides and mudslides or lightning bolts? What do you think? Uh, you know, dude, a every, little bit of all? Every year there's more and more trees. You know, trees fall every year. Yeah. Um, these trees have been stressed. You won't recognize me because I don't have a ski helmet on. <laughs> oh, hey, what's up, dude? How you doing, man? All right. What's going on? Just decided to get out of the house today. Yeah? yeah. Um, same with me. Woods. It hasn't worked yet. Hasn't worked. <laughs> Dang it. I figure I might die by the time I get to the top. Like Mount Everest, they can just leave the There you go. I already died. <laughs> <laughs> well, good to see you, my friend. Yeah. come out Thursday mornings, we meet at 8.30 at Belmont. Uh, I got to be at work at 7 a.m. Oh, yeah, we've been oh, building. Yeah, the, we've been, you know there. 
We've been building the bike ramps for the last two weeks at the chairlift. So. You think they're going to get open on time? Yeah. We're going to open regardless whether they okay, well, we'll come be for there. them. We'll be there. That's why like, we've been really working hard because we're on a time frame. I took a week off of work just to be able to go biking. I took a week off. I took a week off right after we closed. <laughs> we dug out the chairlift and then we came. Yeah, we dug out the I gotta find a place to sit down. I hope he sits and sits and talks with them for a while so I can just enjoy this little bench here. We know it didn't happen. It'll only be a few more months we'll be skiing again, my friend. I know the way it's well you head to Mammoth right now. I know. We were talking of going, but I'm just well, Al went, Navo went, a yeah. bunch of other guys went. Yeah. I'm not going. No, I'm not. I See? Like I was telling you earlier, it ain't going nowhere. And if you're looking for peace, you're, you're moving too fast. You can't see everything. You know what? You're absolutely right, man. You're absolutely right. That's, that's the right way to look at it. Looking for peace, looking for quiet. That's why when I heard those... Yeah. Those youngins come oh, up, I'm like, yeah. it's going to disturb my fucking <laughs> nature. <laughs> yeah. That's why we kind of kept going, so we can like I, I at least make some room sure. between us and them. And so sure. we can hear like, you know, the streams and everything. It's so, yeah, see like, what I've been doing on this hike, the thing that I haven't been doing is what you essentially said, is to smell the roses per se, you know? Yeah. To really focus on those stream sounds and stuff because yeah it's it's such a nice meditative state that all of this can put you in you know yeah. you never know when you're gonna come back you never know like bed rest and stuff like that me and him used to be social workers oh oh cool yeah so good good for you guys man we see like people like in beds and stuff you know what i mean and they haven't got out and stuff like this yeah yeah, like yeah, you're not was, able to, disabled. Yeah, yeah. you can't take it for granted, you know? That's peace. Yeah, come on, right. Definitely. Amen to that. Thank you guys for what you guys did, man. Yeah, thanks, man. That's a beautiful way to live your life. Yeah, yeah so we just. Now, now I'm beer, beer crap, but anyway. <laughs> but anyways, I still work for the people. <laughs> Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Wait. Here, I'll take a picture and send it to you for your girlfriend. Nice. That's my wife. My wife. Your wife. <laughs> I'm sorry. I forget. No, it's here. okay. Uh, it happens so fast. Hold on, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, we go. Thank nice. you, Ray. Do you want me to take a picture of you? No. Okay. Wait, I already have 10 folders full of pictures. You don't have any pictures none. of you? None. I got none. Oh, dude, that's awesome. That's awesome. At least if I get lost, they'll find me really easily because that's a really bright yeah, red shirt. Yeah, the red body. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> All righty. I left my wallet at the house so I wouldn't lose it. Yes, sir. Thank I'm you. Going Thank you. All right. Twice losing my freaking wallet. I that's yeah. That's third time is gonna be that tip. Third time's a charm. I'm not getting it back. <laughs> yeah. Castle Rock right here, right? Yeah. Yes. Perfect. Thank you. Yeah. No problem. You can either go this way. There's some down trees and stuff, but it basically works its way where those people with the white shirt is at. Oh, perfect. And then you just work your way around the backside to get to the top. Right on. Thank you very much. Got Thank it, you, man. You too. Oh, there are a lot of people on this trail. And it gets even uh, way busier. Yeah. I've seen lines of people climbing up from, from the road. I mean lines of people. That air feels so freaking good. Dude, it, it does, doesn't it? Oh, no, dude. Especially out of mildly brisk walking pace oh yeah dude come on now that feels amazing. do i go to the left yeah okay oh yeah there's the trail thing
big sack of rocks. Do you think that's like dog poop or coyote poop? Or well, see, that's better like that than in the plastic than bag. Then leaving the bag, yeah. Yeah. You know, I have to, I'm going to have to, like, if you don't carry it out, just let's leave the poop on the ground, please. That way we're not introducing plastic into the environment as well. Well, no, I agree. Everybody else got this one. Where are you going, Nick? I have no idea. I have no idea. Hey, don't we all? You guys have fun, man. Hey, you two be safe on the way down. Hey, thank you. You be safe on the way up. Of course. Yeah, Ray, I'm just. Uh, <laughs> I'm like an old man who'll just you, just keep walking. I got you. <laughs> That's why it, this trail's a little difficult because it's it's so many sprouter trails, you know. You got that right. <laughs> so these guys are social workers. Good, good people, man. Oh, cool. Yeah. Trail fucking love like that. There's no need not to say hi to any, everybody on the trail, man. I'll always say hi. That's just who I am, you know. Same, dude. Out of the millions of people that live this short distance from here, a small group of individuals that decide to come up here. Yeah. That's true, right? We all have some one like interest. And that's nature. That's that's a good point. You guys, I can't believe I made it all the way up there. The feeling of success. You, you remind me, I, I, it helps me reminisce about when I was like 16 years old. Yeah. Coming up here for the first time. And I felt like it was such a long distance to get there. And you start first catching the glimpses of it. And you're like, damn. Nothing like a new place, dude. Nothing like a new place. 100%. No, totally, bro. That's those little trail guides are. Uh, that seems like a lot of work to, to put those together. Dude, and the crazy <laughs> thing is that they brought cement up here. Wow. Because there's a pole cemented into the ground. Then they put the. I saw them doing it. They put the lattice around it, fill it full of rocks, and then put the cap on. But there's a pole in there. I mean, they're pretty solid. Oh, I can see the pole. Yeah. Yeah, yeah right in the middle. Interesting. Cool, huh? Yeah, totally cool. Trail. All right. I almost have that feeling of wanting to vomit. Why? Oh, just from all all the exercise. It's it's it's, it's pathetic. It's pathetic. Like when I used to do jujitsu all the time. Literally 15 seconds rolling, and I'm sick to my stomach. Really? Oh, dude, it's the most intense workout, bro. Especially when you're trying to avoid being submitted while trying to submit someone. Yeah, it's gnarly. Submit. Yes. I like the term. <laughs> <laughs> That's how it is, though. All right. 
Are we going to the left or, or no here? There you go, you got it. Yeah, I want to go on that one. <laughs> this is too tired, you can see the lake. What are you doing, Nathan? Kitty, you're going to make it. Nathan, I have a touch. Yep. Hello. Hello. Did you bring lunch? <laughs> <laughs> Ray's so funny, dude. <laughs> <laughs> you know how Ray's the other one? They're going rock climbing, evidently. Oh, that's cool. On belay, belay on. Yeah, you did that now with Bowery. That's the only place I did, yep. Yeah. I was into it for a few years after that, bro. But I never really got that far into where I invested the thousands for the rack of, you know, all the stuff. Yeah. Well, and for that stuff, you want to buy the best equipment possible. Oh, yeah, you don't fuck around. Right you don't mess around at all. No, 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 no. No, no, no. no. <laughs> But doing the free rappelling, that scared the, I, I, you know, I was, I was frozen solid. At was the, that the one that got you? Dude, terrified, oh, man. I, I, frozen was, solid. Going up was a little scarier for me. I was like trying to always wait at the back of the line of the pe people doing it, you yeah, know? Yeah, yeah. Because we had like 15 people. That was about our size group too. Yeah. Yep. But as soon as we got to the top and the rappelling started, part started, dude, I was like, I'm on it. Really? Yes, I was on that part. I was so down. Oh, dude, I was in tears. That and the ice climbing up to Mount Silliman. That was amazing. We did like like break falling for like uh, um, on huge slabs of ice, <laughs> which was pretty cool with our picks. Yes. Yeah, man. I I learned a lot up there. It was an interesting trip. Hey Ray, is there a pool up here? Yeah. Yeah, you guys hike or you hike around over there. There's a you can see the whole waterfall. Oh, we did. We saw that one. You did? Yeah. You went over it. Is that the, where we were? Yeah, that's where we were. Oh, okay. There's just a little pool where it comes down. I know we'll see you guys in a second. <laughs> Later, guys. Tag, you're it. Yeah, exactly. Wow, guys. Wow, this is a lot steeper than it looked coming up. How's it going, guys? Hi, Pardon us. Have a nice hike. Thank you. Thank you. Tower bus. Right above us. I wonder if that's the helicopter tour. Do you know much about our helicopter tour up here? Not a damn thing. Okay, because uh, I want to do a video for the channel up there and I'm assuming that they probably have a camera on there and they 
they probably try to sell you the whole trip. I'd imagine so, yes. I'd, I'd be down to spend a hundred bucks on that video. Or maybe he'll let you film for and take you up for a discount. No, to dude, totally. My only worry was that I don't know how to hook up my, my GoPro to the headsets because it's going to be so loud. I've been inside helicopters before and it's, uh, it's going to be so loud. What's up guys? How you doing? How you doing? doing well, doing well. Thank you. You have a great day. Guys, there's a lot of hikers up here. Oh, hey, 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 hey. hey. <laughs> the last two groups have been climbers, dude. Rock climbers? Yeah, did you notice the rope? I, I didn't. Yeah, they all got, uh, they all got all their gear. They're going to be doing a little on belay belay on. Yes, for that. <laughs> yeah, totally. Oh, man, I miss my youth. <laughs> dude, you still charge like you're a youth, bro. You know why, bro? Because I'm out here doing this as much as I physically can. I make a point of it. I literally make a point of it. And that's what, as we get older, we need to do more of this to stay at the level, you know? No, you're, you're, you're so right. So I push myself, dude. And it takes a lot of effort, but my goodness, it's, it's so, it's, it's so worth it. I put up a lot of adulting to do this. <laughs> You know what though? I'd be I I I'll, I'd be just working right now and watching TV in between my work, so that's just a huge waste of time. So look, we started like what about 8:45, about 10:45, few hours of your day. How's it going, guys? Yeah, you doing? doing well, thank you. Have a safe hike. Thank you. I'm like a pro now. Hey, enjoy your hike. Hey, have have a safe hike. So we've been out for for two hours. Yeah. Wow. It's about two hours. I can see the road. Hello. Hi. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> Watch your dress. Yeah, totally. Yeah, I guess walking down isn't as easy as I thought it was going to be. Oh. How's it going? Good, how you doing? Doing well, thanks man. You guys have a good hike. Oh, Thank you. Excuse us. Oh. I'll take your time. <laughs> Thank you. It's a cool walking stick. <laughs> take care. Like green, wonderful. Like no, no. Good morning. Good morning. How you doing? Good. How was it? Oh, it was great. Beautiful. Beautiful. Enjoy. Everyone's so cool up here, man. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> I barely caught that one. <laughs> Jeez, Ray. I barely caught that one. <laughs> Morning. Good morning. Have a safe hike, guys. All right, thank you. Too. Yep, thank you. I'm so enthusiastic because we already made it. Okay. Yeah, go around the back of the tree. The back of the tree. Yeah. Okay. That's the front of the tree. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but it's all the same. I just want to. I just want to make things more difficult. Are we going up here? No, this way. Okay. Right Dang, Ray. Right okay. You see the little white markers? Like this is going to be a trail someday or something. That's not one of the white markers, right? No, that's... <laughs> a little trash bug. So that's the main way up? Yeah. Okay. This is the local shortcut. You guys are getting the local shortcut, but the parking, I've been told that uh, 
I got to keep that private. <laughs> yeah. Come early so you can get a spot on the highway. Correct. Oh, I see the trail here. Okay. Okay, you got it. Oh, I'm going up here, right? Yeah, the two is right there. Okay, okay. Hey guys, as I said, forgive me about some of the cursing. I didn't say anything. But we're just out here being boys, and it seemed like a lot of people we ran into were saying the same things. So right down there, that's the parking lot for this hike. And it's always so full. Guys, that was a lot of work. Ah. You good? Whoa. Sounds like a spaceship above us. Uh, yeah, dude, that's such a trip. What is that? Is that from the sound going from this side of the mountain to this side, maybe? Or? I think it's just the angle of the jet engine. That is such a trippy like a sound. To us? Yeah. And look, there it goes back the other way. I, 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 don't, I don't have another a grill. <laughs> but I. Here and it's like, what the hell? <laughs> when I was a kid, airplanes didn't sound like that. Yeah, yeah. Did they have airplanes when you were a kid? <laughs> 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 yeah, you know those guys, you heard the right brothers? Yeah, yeah, those were your neighbors, right? Yeah. <laughs> they took some old bicycles and <laughs> some kind of thing. From your bike, right? <laughs> crazy, crazy boys. <laughs> oh, that way, okay. Oh, man. All right, guys, when we get down to the street, I'm going to turn off the camera and say goodbye. And thank you guys for cruising with us. For the one person still watching, just know that right now we're having the Spartan races up here. And it's just a uh, super endurance type of stuff. So a lot of people come up here to test themselves. Are we going that way? Yeah. Okay. And knowing is half the battle. G.I. Joe was there. Huh? You think you'd find your way back again? Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah? Now, now, yes. Now I could. Because I'll be following the people and those rock piles. Alright, well this is the end of the road guys, this is our Castle Rock end here, thank you guys for cruising with us, thank Ray again for helping us out, the guy is the man, 
Um, if you guys enjoy what I do, please like and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. I do work really hard on this channel. Um, and it, it does help. So thank you for everything. Have a great weekend. And uh, we will talk to you later. Love you guys. Bye.